Hello and welcome to another Advent devotion from Hope Lutheran Church. We're continuing our series looking at light in the darkness, how Jesus comes into the darkness of this world as the light of God and shines his light into our darkness. We're continuing today in the Gospel of Matthew. Jesus has been declared to be that light of the world, the fulfillment of the prophecy from Isaiah. The people who walk in darkness have seen a great light. And now in Matthew chapter 5, we get to the Sermon on the Mount, the Beatitudes. And here's what it says. Seeing the great crowds, he went up on the mountain, and when he sat down, his disciples came to him. And he opened his mouth and taught them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they shall be satisfied. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall receive mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called sons of God. Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness' sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you when others revile you and persecute you and utter all kinds of evil against you falsely on my account. Rejoice and be glad, for your reward is great in heaven. For so they persecuted the prophets who were before you. Jesus says, blessed, 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 again and again and again and again. Why is it that they can be considered blessed? It's not because they have uh, qualities that make them blessed. Being poor in spirit is not really something that we are to strive for, but rather it's a reality. Jesus comes to people who are poor in spirit, those who are in the valley of the shadow of death, and he says, you're blessed. Why is it that they can be considered blessed? Why? Because Jesus is there. The light of the world has come. The people walking in darkness have seen a great light. And as they listen to Jesus, as they look to Jesus, as they trust in Jesus... They are blessed in spite of the fact that they are poor in spirit, in spite of the fact that they mourn, in spite of the fact that they are hungering and thirsting for righteousness. They are blessed because Jesus is there as their blessing. And he says, because of him, those blessings will be theirs in heaven. Those blessings will be ours in heaven because the light of the world has come. God's blessings. Have a great day. And I look forward to spending more time in God's word with you again tomorrow.